Hi, I'm Ryan Levine with Utah Working Capital. Now I'd like to talk about how to best analyze balance sheet. When looking at financial statements, investors, managers, owners of companies, or other stakeholders can evaluate different aspects of the business simply by looking at different uh, equations within the balance sheets. I like to talk about four main uh, ratios uh, that, that people can use to analyze balance sheets. It can give them better understanding to how the business is operating and, and how well their business is doing uh, in the market today. The first set of ratios is liquidity ratios. These ratios are helped to the um, help the analyst understand how liquid the company is, how quickly they can turn uh, their current assets into cash. The three main ratios within the liquidity ratios are one, current ratios, two, quick ratios, and three, cash ratios. The current ratios uh, are simply calculated by taking the current assets uh, and dividing them by the current liabilities. The quick ratio is taken just by uh, taking the short-term investments and likewise dividing them by current liabilities. And the cash ratio is simply taking uh, the cash balance and dividing it by the current liabilities. The second set of ratios is debt ratios. This helps an analyst understand how much debt the company has and whether it's healthy to have that much debt or whether they could even accumulate more debt. Uh, the first debt ratio is the debt ratio, which is simply taking uh, the total liabilities and dividing it by the total assets. This understands, uh, helps an analyst understand uh, if the company has so many liabilities that its assets are not able to cover it or vice versa if the company has enough assets to pay off all of its remaining debt. The second ratio is the debt to equity ratio which is simply taking uh, the total debt and dividing it by the um, total owner's equity. This ratio helps um, an analyst understand if the company has too much debt to, the, to where it's not able to pay off its owners um, or vice versa if it has um, little debt it'll be able to pay off its owners very well. The third set of ratios are profitability ratios. These help um, analysts understand how profitable the company is based on the number of uh, assets as well as the number of liabilities that it has. The first ratio uh, within the profit profitability ratio set is the return on assets. This is simply calculated by taking the net income, dividing it by total assets. This helps people understand how efficiently a company is actually using the assets that it owns. The second ratio is return on equity. This is calculated by taking net income and dividing it by owner's equity. This helps analysts understand how well a company is taking the equity that it's received from its owners and how well it's utilizing it and turning it into profits. The fourth type of ratio is investment ratio. Uh, the two uh, main ratios within this group um, are, are meant for investors looking to invest in the company to see how well the, uh, the company its stock will pay off uh, over time. The first ratio is the price earnings ratio. Uh, this is simply calculated by taking the um, stock price per share and dividing it by earnings per share that the company has been able to accomplish over time. The second one is the dividend yield. Uh, this is taken by taking the, the annual dividend per share that's paid out to stockholders um, and dividing it by the stock price per share. The dividend yield helps investors understand how well a company is able to pay dividends and what type of return they'll see on their investment. For further additional questions, contact us at utworkingcapital at gmail.com.